Yo on there. Yeah, because it's starting. Shalom. First and foremost, I'm going to begin by giving all praises, all honor, all glory to Yahweh, Ba'ashem, Yahushai, Ba'ashem, Akar Kodash, the Bible of the Apostles, and the Lord of Great News, too, not real well. See, Joe, but in this sense, I came in the four corners of the year, they're pushing this gospel in the whole sense here. Yeah, it should. But there's some great news, we should share that. Back out on a Monday, so, you know, feed the sheep. So, you know, today was the day of atonement, and here yeah, sunset. Locally here in Trinidad, with a Yapa one though. You know, we hope them spirits come up our way and we grow in the spirit. And you know, we that we endure every year and every year and every year until the coming of our Lord. Right. Because we understand that we fight against, you know, spirits. We left hand side, coming at we. Every day, every day we come and say, once you win this, it's trying to sit out that day. The scripture say, say it, tell me um, how shy tell Peter, say it, tell me that the scripture is weak. You know, he went out. Come out and let's read it in this. You know, and I go to work for all the people. The only the, 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 the elect to make it. But the elect don't see, no matter what. The elect see. So, you know. Go and just flow through the spirit and pour your yeah, bash in your yeah. shell. Yeah, yeah. Give me a soul. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Are you jumping? Huh? Are you jumping? Make sure it's a double. Come in? Yeah, come in. Right? I'll tell you how. Yeah. Hey, you got to get to where we are. Yeah, I'm saying, bro. You go in, I was I small. Huh? So I say, no, what I'm saying is, I feel better for you guys. Yeah, 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 yeah. But you're happy to be on that side because that's stinky. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey! Can't see that kind of zoo. Right, yeah. Go there. Right. Yeah, you guys, you guys go there. Let me see. Thank you. 
five seats or thin and press or thin. Okay, pray often and fast often. You understand? Which, which, you know, like I, as I was doing with Nyan, Big Brother Brothers, we now be doing it last night. Like, going into the day of atonement. Everything the Heavenly Father gives, the laws, the statutes, the commandments, things contained in the laws, they have, they have benefits, not just physical um, solar, not just spiritual benefits. Is that physical benefits thing too? Like when the Lord say don't eat, don't eat swine. Spiritually, boy, you will get connected to your power because you will calcify your pineal gland. With, 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 such, with such food, you defile in the temple, right? But on a physical, on a physical aspect, it is swine does many damages to the body, physically. When the Lord said, don't be a sodomite. Physic spiritually, you're defiling your temple. Right? But then physically, you put in your rut in a, in a, you know, in a rain. Yeah. Is that no life coming out there? On the, on the physical? So when the Lord said, fast. Spiritually, you're, you're connected to your power. Right? You get more closer to your power, but on a spiritually, you can to your power, but on a physical level, on a physical level, you're training the body for days to come. Like when the when the um, the MOTV arrives, you already your body already trained to constant fasting to go days without eating, to go days without drinking. So if that is the scenario you find yourself in on here. Hey, guess what? I, I prep. You don't be like fish out of water in them days. Right? And then beside that, you have, when you're fasting, as your big brother ever said, you understand? You're, you're, you're totally detoxing the body. And it's like a reset to the body, to the, to the systems in your body, it's reset. You understand? You when you're going to search, you put you on a fast. Right. So it has physical aspects, but it has spiritual aspects, and then there's physical aspects to the laws of the most high, which proves that the Heavenly Father is genuinely merciful. He, he, he all wrong, he's looking out for you. The Lord is just looking out for you and, and looking out for you at the same time. He's looking out for you. The individual. That's why you tell it, don't, don't, don't mix fabric, right. the garment. Right. Because when you, when you mix it, you put, you put your cup to the zero. You put your body on a, on a zero balance then. Correct. So I can see if I see it right. But you know when you, when you wear um, all, all that linen, you set the 5,000. See? Wool. The wool is 3,000. See? If I remember correctly, you see? But when you mix them, no, it's correct. It's nothing. Nothing. And you believe for that only thing, and that's why you get a Levitical law on what to eat as well for your body. For your body. Then help, it, it, it completely, it's all the way helpful. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It helps in your spiritually and in the physical. So it's showing, the, it's showing you how merciful you have in Father is. Yeah. That's showing you how merciful you are. Alright, it's not like you know, it's not Jake's out here. They give you something, they're expecting something in return. Right, right, he right. gives something for something. Yeah. The Lord giving you something to help you. Right? To help you, help you just live better. He looking back for nothing in return when he gives you that. So, this is how merciful the Lord is. But you people still refuse the Lord. You still refuse the heavenly Father. Because why? You just rebel yourself. You ain't getting yourself. Nah, it's not Sip, sip, sip. I know that. But hey, we all we know the precept. The Lord tells um Matthew, not Matthew, Peter told him Satan has desired to save thee as we 
but I have prayed for you. Right? So Satan desire in this world, as we in this world, is to sift us as we. To sift us as we. But 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 guess what? And what, what Peter is? Peter is what? David. Who? No, but no, what? Who Peter is? Peter is David. And see that Peter is David. Yes, in that Peter is David, we are striving to be the house of David. Satan is trying to serve the house of David as we. But once we, once we constantly in the spirit, Satan has no power over us. That's why we are constantly in the spirit that God is in the star coming down the road here as we have to. They are talking about David what? Encourage themselves in the Lord. When he was feeling down, what do you do with yourself? He did let him down, he let him conquer him. He encouraged himself, he took up himself, and he said, It's time to go out there and, and, and get more stern in the Lord. Not that he was, he was slacking. He's on the book of 1 Samuel 30 and verse 6. It says that David was greatly distressed for the people's sake, for the people spake of stoning him, because the soul of all the people was grieved, every man for his sons and for his daughters. But David encouraged himself in our Bashan Yahushua's power. Alright? So he was feeling grieved, feeling down in the spirit. And when you feel impressed in the spirit, that way you have to do. Encourage yourself in the Lord. I got that man that will feel grieved in the spirit and turn the back on the Lord. Like this one with the one Malik, who said the most high was a setback for him. Yeah. The man literally said the most high, you see, there is the most high. The man said the most high was a setback. He had a very few setbacks in life, you know, trying to correct and. and, and I was like, really the setback. That was a setback. He didn't encourage himself in the heavenly father. Because Satan outside here had, had his precepts. I'm going to get a really, really quick easy book. Uh, 1 Peter 5. And uh, verse 8. It says, Be sober. Be vigilant because your adversary, the devil, as a roaring lion, walketh about seeking whom he may devour. Right? Satan outside here, he looking for souls. He looking to conquer you. And you have to be, you have to be sober, you have to be vigilant, you have to watch for the devil slip. And I, you can't even watch. You didn't watch. So the devil caught him. And when, when Satan catch him, that is a day for him. The scripture says, seven more unclean spirits, more, seven more spirits, more unclean than himself, and into to that man. And the latter state that that man was worse than the beginning. And it's clear to see. Yahweh Shai never lie yet. Yahweh Shai say things, and up to now he didn't tell a lie yet. Up to now. That's clear to see. Because when this Jake was in the truth, this Jake had one tattoo here. Yeah. Yeah. And he feel bad about it. Yeah. I see the Jake have a big tattoo across the chest. You see that? Yeah. yeah. Latin worse. <laughs> Latin worse than wow. the first. Condemning yourself more. Because why? The Lord rejects you. And you want to be bitten by, by, by many stripes. But you need no. No better. You come in here feeling bad about that, and then when you're gone, you take a bigger one. You know, you really know, you can beat my many shites, but you don't know. The few shites, like these people out here, you go punk them, nothing you know. Them didn't come into this and go away. They know what they mean, they, they go know because we was out here, so they have no excuse. They go beat my few shites, but you coming into this. Man. <laughs> <laughs> Worse to you, man. <laughs> yeah. For sure. 
En dan nooit een ijs met ijs uit en domi is ziek. Een ijs met ijs uit en domi is ziek. Wat wil je alles? En wie kan hier dan zien? Wat wat meneer houden scheisse? Wie dat dat ijs is ziek dat ding? Wie dat dan doet? 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 But if you could perceive and if you could understand, I'm going back to the, the, um, the, the, the back in the idea, the sixth chapter would be a great father, um, to the angel, um, used to, to bind the, the masses of the people. I'm going back to them. Alright? You have any father, you have a bash, you have a shy, use that angel to blind the masses of the people. But, but then there was, some who the Lord say, who the Lord tell them angels, go blind them. See them there, go blind them. Them how to see. Them how to know. Them how to see and them how to know. And, and we have an opportunity now that we in this truth. Once we endure to be the ones who the Lord had our favor on. To see and to know. Not just see and know because you could see with your heart because you have, you have vision and you have freaking a brain in your head. Or you have our ears. Now, tap it. Because look, right now, as we preach this word, many of you people cannot receive it because you don't have the eyes to see and the ears to hear. Yeah. And, and ultimately, the Lord is in his eye, you all. Exactly. Because they say, for a mark on them that cry and sigh and cry, right? A mark there is a mark of exemption, also means someone that the Lord desires. So he desire these men here yeah, and cry and sigh and cry. But the Lord didn't desire them. So he keep them under that blind state. Undesirable. Can't. That's a sad thing to reach the middle of that state because everything was in the heavens before it was on earth. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so your faith was done destined <laughs> up there. That's sad. And I, and I think like if we as hope members of the elect bro. I don't really have any father all praises, right? Uh, yeah. But everything, everything happened up there. Everything. What we see in here is just, it's just a, a play, you know, of what was already, of, of what already took place up there. It just played out in the flesh. But the, but the movie was already up there. So, so the heavenly father up there, the heavenly father, you have a bash, I mean, I was right. Set aside to the spirits. So when they had to come down on the earth, they will be destroyed. Mm. He set aside certain spirits. You see, this is the thing that's going into predestination. And a, a, a lot of people don't believe that. A lot of, especially these Christians. You talk to them about being predestinated. They don't like, they don't want to hear that. But predestination is a part of the scriptures. Everybody's destiny was already determined before they come down on earth. So then therefore, there is no free will. You cannot choose for yourself because the destiny was already made for you by the Heavenly Father. Uh, present it. It's um, first Peter chapter 2 and verse 7. Unto you therefore which believe he is precious, but unto them which be dis disobedient, the stone which the bill has disallowed, the same is made the head of the corner and a stone of stumbling, and a rock of offense, even to them which stumble at the word, being disobedient, whereunto also they were appointed. Uh, see? <laughs> see? Appointed. So, they was appointed to, 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 to stumble. The Lord appoint you that. That's your lot. Your lot, when you go down on earth, you're going to stumble at, our, at the Lord, you have a shy, you wouldn't like him. Hey, that's fucking that dread. Dread. All right, dread. Dread. Each day you had to be thankful, you know, to water your yeah, wash me on the side. Then we on this side. Then we on this side because you had no choice in it. Yeah, we have no choice in it. We have no choice. You had no hope. I used to just say, don't boast. Not that not works that every man said boast. Nah. We have nothing. No works. No thousand works. You did it for uh, three, or three years, four years, uh, ten years. Most say, do you care about that? That works, that thing he just wanted to give you this. Oh. Hey. Whoa. <laughs> whoa. That, whoa, I know that again, mercy. 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 Mm -hmm. But that, that's, that's very scary because I mean, you have no choice in, in no matter because no matter. You, it, it's up in heaven itself. 
Brandon Satonut, Julian Chulier, the Italian Satier. It's up in heaven. Everything was set. The two turns were set up there. The elect was set up there. The wicked was set up there. Who will be the Moabites was set up there. Who will be the Ammonites was set up there. Who will be the Harites when they come on earth? They were set up there. Who will be the Ishmaelites? Who will be the Israelites? Who will be the the spirits are going to be the Israelites, the spirits are going to be the elect of the Israelites. Alright? His son, everything. What his son will not receive, everything was already set up there. That's why I say the angels are kept not their first estate. Our first estate was up in the heavens. The Lord eventually sent us down here. Because he wrote a, he wrote a script, he had the he was meant to play what people play it out. He had to to play out. So that way we had a hope like hell, we on the Lord's good side every single day. Yeah. Yeah. Romans 9 and verse And verse 18, therefore at ease, therefore, read that verse 16. Now start at 15. It says, for he said to Moses, I will have mercy on whom I will have mercy, and I will have compassion on whom I will have compassion. So then it is not him that will it, nor of him that run it, but Yahweh, by Hashem Yahushai, that show it mercy. For the scripture said unto Pharaoh, even for this purpose, even for the same purpose have I raised thee up, that I might show my power in thee, and that my name might be Declared toward all earth. Therefore, at the mercy on whom he will have mercy, and whom he will be handed, thou wilt say then unto me, Why doth he yet find fault? For who had resisted his will? <laughs> Nay, but O man, who art thou that replies against power? Shall the thing shall the thing form say to him? That form it, why hast thou made me thus? <laughs> I said, that's how the Lord make it, I really want to know. You, you, the Lord, that's not outside. Everybody inside the Lord box. <laughs> Men like to say we just think outside the box because he's a fucking atheist. Yeah, inside the Lord box, he put you to be a fucking atheist. How about that? <laughs> destined to be a atheist. <laughs> you destined, you, the Lord in heaven say you for you to be an atheist. <laughs> I am thinking outside the box because some other doctrine that you tell yourself you're holding on to outside of the Bible. Guess what? Our Basham Yahushai put you like that. It's not escaping our Basham Yahushai. Men who leave the truth, who say to find some new way. The Lord is who sent you out the truth. Alright? The Lord say, get, yo, I know. But you in your mind telling yourself that. Yeah, I need a boy because that is a man I find. Yeah. That is a cult. That is a cult. The Lord, who were you to say that is a cult? Because this is the truth. It didn't have no other way but this way that we teach in here right now. Despite what you might think, Christianity, despite what Islam say, despite what some Hebrew Israelite groups even say. But there are Hebrew Israelite groups who don't push the 100% truth. Despite what them are not even say, what we have, we have the hundred percent truth, right. that rock solid truth, and we could challenge anybody to tell us that they know the scriptures, and we will prove them to be liars. Right. Because once you're not coming up in this doctrine that we teaching, you are lying. All right, because we teaching the truth. Scripture says that we and every man a liar. Yeah, because why? You, you, you preach the words out here, we fire. Whosoever teaching, um, what is that? That a man speak as the oracles. So he speak that. So he speak that. 3 and 12, right? 4 and 12. Uh, for sure. 4 and 12. So it's Peter. Chapter 4 and verse 11. If any man speak, let him speak as the oracles of power. If any man minister, let him do it 
as of the ability which power giveth, that Yahweh in all things may be glorified through Yahweh Shai and Mashiach, to whom be praise and dominion forever and ever. Amen. Exactly. So if you're talking, you're not talking concerning the scriptures, you're not talking your own words. That was some people that do. But guess what? The Lord wanted you to do that. So that's why we who are the truth, as the scripture read, until you believe he's precious, we want to shoot hey, with precious stars. Now it, it will look like we're mad because this world tells us them getting true. But guess what? We getting true. Hey, Yahweh Shai say, rejoice. Go rejoice that the spirits being made subject unto you. Which is a, which is a Yapa thing. Now you are Spirits being made subject to you like, whoa. You go talk to that spirit and tell that spirit. Kill that man. And you had to listen to it? Yeah, I don't know. 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 One skiba, two, and the second son, who say, they were exorcists. And the, and the city of the power of the apostle Paul. And they say, hey, I can't sell by who? By Yahweh Shai, who Paul preach. And this person, Yahweh Shai, I know, Paul, I know, but who are that one? Be them, right? Yeah, yeah. So this person being made subject to her is because Ooh. it does some men, it does some men, the spirits don't be subject to them. Mm -hmm. Just mm -hmm. like that same, them same man. So that is a bad thing. But Yahweh Shai goes a step further and say, rejoice that your name is written in heaven. He said, don't even rejoice that you gain us a power like that. Power like that on earth. Rejoice that your name should be where the heavenly father is. That is our thing, joy. Wow. Because not many people could get up. Yeah, 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 yeah. You understand? Know, 20 people's names cannot be written by your house church. And that is where we're striving to be. Yeah. Alright? Despite whatever niggles and transgressions we do in this life, we still serve, we have tried to serve the Heavenly Father. Right? Best that we have. Best that we have ability. Despite, you know, because hey, at the end of the day, the Lord is all our matters, but we died like God. Yeah. Even your fucking children, your girls, your, your, your mother, your father, Nobody has a matter about your how about Shami Abu Shai and the ministry and the brotherhood. That is all that matters. That is all that matters at the end of the day. When it's all said and done, all that matters is the Heavenly Father's ministry and the Akia. The sincere Akia. The sincere Akia. The Akia who will come and the fucking coming in like crap. Like this fucking money that I don't come back to you. Wasn't it bad? You leave there. You just fucking there, bro. You yeah, understand? You, you, you come and get all the heavenly gifts. So you get it. So the, the bad was something different. We, his brothers, right. on, always there. That being taught, you're getting teaching, you're getting teaching, you're getting teaching, you're getting teaching. So you are no fucking excuse. No excuse. Coming in like a crab sideways. Yeah. You know? Not yeah. straight forward now. You're probably creeping in sideways now. Now you show you fucking wicked. 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 We bring you into the bad boy. See, see, the, the most high was a setback in your life. Hmm. Learning about the most high, and the most high, one keeps setting your back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> one just keeps setting your back. No progression. You know why? Because you're wicked by. Like wickedness, right? I don't preach up on him here, yeah, 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 yeah. Let me bring it down. Even uh, Sirach, Sirach said. <laughs> Sirach, Sirach 26 and 28, it says, There be two things that grieve my heart, and the third make me angry. A man of war that suffered poverty, and men of understanding that are not set by, and one that returneth 
from righteousness to sin. The Lord prepared such an one for the sword. That way you can you you that way you prepare you can prepare yourself for the sword. Prepare yourself. But that's a shock sir. Even if you climb, even if you do climb, but the most I set your back, you go up, you set back, you see that sword is destined for you. So the scripture says in Hebrews, um, how it go? It's impossible. It's impossible for such a one. Yeah, yeah. That taste yeah. that he heavenly gift, yeah. Now say the Lord, say, how oh, the Lord will set you back. Who is you, right? The knowledge, the Lord. You know about the had some major setbacks in my life, you know? The Lord, you know about the Lord, you know about the Lord, you know about the Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, is that a setback? That's a setback to you, right? Salvation is a setback. Men do believe in it. The gate that the prison opened on there, and you get to come in to be on this side, and it, where, where it was on that side, you get to come up on this side, uh -huh. on a garment, yeah. a glorious garment. Yeah. Oh, the garment is glorious, yeah. yeah. You see, you <laughs> see that guy, men like. I rather then accept Yahweh Shai too. Because Yahweh Shai ain't come glorious. Right. Come, you come like a lowly man. See now you can't be the Lord right. Glitz and the glam, that's what the niggas like now. Mm -hmm. Glitz and glam. If you don't have that, then you can't follow you. But then how you gonna find out if a man genuine? True, true, true. You know what I'm saying? True. Can't find out if a man genuine? Yeah, go with Sirach here as well. <coughs> I feel it like Sirach 6. Try your friend. Try your friend. Correct. Yeah. So prove your it. friend first. Prove your friend first. Yeah. And the way the Lord doing, the Lord proving to see if these men for really for him. Correct. Put them in the low. Make them fall. Make them lose everything in his life. Give up things. And really see, hey, life dies, my friend. Yeah. Make because, them gaze and stuff. Yeah. Would the Lord you see no more? I call your servants, but friends. friends. And, and would the scripture say, hey, I try your friend first? Exactly. Because in, in adversity they will flee. Exactly. They only be there in the table when the table nice. Mm -hmm. And we see I see that in the world. The most. I see that. As I fall, them niggas gone. <laughs> As I fall, niggas gone. No no not a nigga to be found. Yeah. Yeah. But when things up again, everybody crawling. Everybody crawling. And the Lord not for that. So he trying out the friends. Yeah. So you leave because things was getting too hard. You could never be the most high friend. I don't know, I don't know because. The most high riches is his own. Every he, he, he created it. Mm -hmm. And everything I'm um, making a, a earthly man rich right now come from the earth. Whether it's gold he has, whether he has silver, he has gold, he has rubies, he has diamonds, whatever. All them things come from the earth. Who created the earth? Yeah. Scripture says the earth is the Lord and the full so, yeah. so the Lord created it. So how rich he is. This is his own. So he don't bump for, to, for you to be rich to serve me, he are riches. Right, you right. are to impress him some other way. Can't. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> you got to come up some yeah, next yeah, way yeah. To, to show him. You got you to come to the Lord with riches and impress him. Right, right, yeah, 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 yeah. Come yeah. some more else, come on next way. That is the way. Ooh, but, but, but Solomon. That is it. Solomon didn't ask for the riches, he asked for wisdom. Damn. And now he said, because thou asked. For wisdom, I'll give you all things. I'll give you all things. Wisdom, everything, even the riches. Even the riches. Which is a byproduct of the wisdom. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Because that's what we have right now. We don't have the physical riches, but we have the wisdom, knowledge, and understanding. The Holy Spirit, mm -hmm. and the Heavenly Father, the understanding of this book, which is the true riches. True. And by holding on to this, we will receive the tangible riches. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You understand? Let me read this is Hebrews 6 and, and 4. It says, for it is impossible for those who were once enlightened and have tasted of the heavenly gift and were made partakers of the Holy Spirit and have tasted the good word of the Most High and the powers of the world to come, if they shall fall away to renew them again unto repentance, seeing they crucify to themselves the Son of the Most High afresh and put him to an open shame. It's impossible for you to come back into this. Scripture said, we said, yeah. 
l'autre c'est qu'il y a un aussi, un homme qui y a un homme aussi. Mais il y a un scope qui a assez. Donc nous allons prendre un homme qui a assez. C'est impossible de renouer ce genre. Oui. Et pourtant, il y a un homme qui a toujours été un homme qui a toujours été un homme. Exception to the rules. You mm-hmm. lot to do a mercy on anybody. When they play for that, you lot to bring them up. Yeah. Uh, then, but, but you don't want to take that chance. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You, don't, you don't want to take that chance. Like the prodigal son. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. He, fell out, he fell away. He fell out. Took him back. Yeah. You don't want to be the one who take that chance to see what he did. Yeah. You see the future? Like we come back, yeah, when, when it's at a speed up and come, see it's at a speed up and I said, well, yeah, well, it's really done there now. Yeah. I'm going to try to come back, so I can talk on a garment, so I can set a pitch. Yeah. You go ahead, I'm not taking that no, fucking job. Right. I don't risk it, man. Fuck that. <laughs> I took that to risk it. Yeah, it's not yeah. risky, man. And that is not fair. No, no, yeah. We, we pay the heavenly yeah, fire. That's, that's why we're here. Living life on the edge, bro. I live life on the edge. I, know, I never like to live life on the edge. <laughs> I like to play safe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You don't like to even drive too fast. I, I like to play safe. Right, right. I like to fucking live life on the edge. Yeah, like, like he saw, like, say, he saw go on the top of a cliff. Yeah. And the edge of the cliff and try to take a selfie. And take a selfie, right. Jake not doing them kind of fucking yeah, madness. madness. Play on we ghost. Play on the ghost, it's empty the lawn. Empty the lawn. We play long and I slip. It's just be that game for Yeah, yeah. And, and, and when they do that, and it's, not, it's not, just, not just this one that called me. That or that. Man who bring me the truth. La ha. Right. Yeah. You don't think he's going to tell He bring me the truth, man. It's up here. Okay? Malak. There's men who was used to be in my house. Sleep in my knee. Wow! She said she's not going back to Chiangen. Huh? No! No! She's got this horse, boy! You could want to know that yellow Chiangen. That thing loose, you want me to know that. Fucking mileage, fucking way up. That way up. That guy up by the teaching these women. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just be loose. So plenty of them are sick. Mm-hmm. Those weight, they're getting sick. Yep. She could be sick, but possibly she could just be under pressure or exercising. But that was different look from exercising slimness mm-hmm. to sick slimness. Yeah, that was yeah. different look. Yeah, right, right, right. That was different look. I like she knows that upon more side. Yeah? She is? Yeah. You see it. She was more dry than that. No, I said I got it. I said I got it. Right. Mm-hmm. So I thought she was sick. That is sick. <laughs> <laughs> And them girls still proud of them. Head still up. Where the fuck, man? What would it take to cool you down? Yeah, yeah. You don't dry up, eh? Looking like how you still got you still up proud. Yeah. And I'm making it. Right, it's a killer. Killer, man. Yeah, now you go say, see, I'm dead. I'm 14. And walk with the head up. Yeah. She broke a second and just shot the eight. I'm 51. 15. It says, For many great miseries shall be done to them that in the latter time shall dwell in the world because they have walked in great pride. Right? And that is them, you know, mainly them too. Mm-hmm. The head all the way, as they say, the head up to the. Where your head up to? You, where, where is you? And you know why these women are them so proud too? These men. Are, 
Mm-hmm. Men toss the yeah, boys. So run them down. Yeah. See how girls look here. I mean, they're, they're, they're some thing. sweet girls out here too. Eh? Yeah, they're really, they're really pretty. I mean, like, you don't see them, I mean, in life, you know, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. In life, like you're walking in. Uh, on, yeah, you see, I see a thing. Nice girls. Yeah, nice nice girls. But, not, that's not to, for you to be like. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like a fucking. Yeah. Talk behind them. Come down, like, some fucking. And these men and them know how that. You go every time they see. And then these women and them revealing everything these days, so you see them naked. Right. And then they might see that. As I was saying, these states where we are saying we just call them reds down here, they just call them red bone up in the states. Mm-hmm. You see a nice little reds, and, 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 and she, she revealing everything before you. Yeah. Men must be yeah. family, thing. Oh, and the might see, I think you're not so nice. She's not so pretty. But because they're so thirst, mm-hmm. they're running she down the same way. Guy, yeah, hey, these women, these women, are, they're not so, they're not so, what, what is the word, man? Valuable. Valuable. Some valuable. Yeah. For you to be like a dog behind them, so now, right? Yeah, some integrity, sense, man. some integrity, These men don't have no integrity within themselves. That's why these women just do them what the fuck they want. And make them drink poison, and make them like that chick, and they fuck themselves. Okay. And videotape it, right? Because why you tell yourself you get you get Queen Elizabeth or not, not Elizabeth you get the Queen you get the, the Queen the prize you get the prize woman mm-hmm. and and then it turn, turns out she's just a little rat she's just a little whore who can be trusted and then where do you get yeah, 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 yeah. you want to kill yourself for that and you make a fool out there yourself. Make a fool out there yourself. You just kept just saying, many have run out of there with a woman. woman. Yeah. You even go down and die with integrity and just go and kill yourself. Man. You're going with that double mind. <laughs> yeah, right. You're going with that fucking double mind. Yeah, right. Ah, don't want to do again. Nah, change my mind. Change your mind? But you're not a backup plan in case you change your mind. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So you're dead. Your son, you have your little son trying to help you. Yeah, right. Your little son trying to take you down. He can't take me to do, he can't help you. So you, you go out in a shameful way and all, because of a power woman. Damn. The men are not so prolific and bad. Truth more valuable than a woman. It was proven by our, our forefathers, the Rubel Ben. He proved it. Because when he done come up with that scenario, even the, even, even the, um, the knowledge contest basically, yep. which one more powerful? Wang, the king, woman, the truth. And he brought up with his knowledge, truth is the most powerful thing on the earth. Truth prevails. Truth prevails. strong. Yep. So I want to here the lamb. First, I just want 320. It says, the man leaveth his own father that brought him up and his own country and cleave it unto his wife. He sticketh not to spend his life with his wife and remember it neither father nor mother nor country. By this also you must know that women have dominion over you. Do you not labor and toil and give and bring all to the woman? Yea, man taketh a sword and goeth his way to rob and to steal and then change the day. Plenty of the crime situation. Behind it, behind it is Eve. Behind it is our female. Right? Plenty of the crime is in the country. Behind that, the man doing that, he gives some. Right? It says, Yea, man take the sword and go this way to rub and to steal, to sail upon the seas and upon the rivers. And look it upon a lion and go it in the darkness. And when he had stolen, spoil and rob, he bring it to his lust. Wherefore a man loveth his wife better than father or mother. Yea, many there be that have run out of their wits for women and became servants for their sakes. And there is a lot of men in this world too. They become servants. The, the, the whole life is to serve that female. But guess what? A female not trustworthy. 
she may have fought with, with Satan without even putting up a fight in every Genesis. Mm -hmm. So you can trust that. She ain't even resisting. Scripture says she just give in. And Satan come to she. She ain't even say, hey, husband, tell them nothing. But yeah. you know what? I'm not eating. She just eat. Yeah. <laughs> she just eat. Get, get her story, you know, for me. No, for sure. Yeah. She has this tree. <laughs> Let's say the most high. The most high said oh you tell the food, but she has bound out of the same touch. But she eventually she gave it. But it's good. This tree has a lot of the truth. And the woman said unto the serpent, We may eat of the fruit of the trees of the garden. But of the fruit of the tree which is in the midst of the garden, power had said, Ye shall not eat of it, neither shall he touch it, lest he die. Right. And the serpent said unto the woman, Ye shall not surely die, for, yeah, for power doth know that in the day ye eat thereof, then your eyes shall be opened, and ye shall be as gods, knowing good and evil. So one little thing is going to tell her, and she just changed her whole perspective. It's clear to see the woman and them, like Glenn Washington said, of Paris and them. She fell for one of them sweet lights. <laughs> you understand? Yep. So if a jack is the mark to come around every Monday, Tuesday, or even Thursday, you understand? But he said, he loves she from the bottom of his heart. Yeah. I'm telling she will I love you. But she keep calling for Jack. Because Jack is thinking she lies. Jack is thinking she them lies, but he genuinely loves she. That is his woman. Any little thing you tell them, they go fall for it. The, the heads plenty of them heads so. Said verse 6, and when the woman saw that the tree was good for food, and that it was pleasant to the eyes, and a tree, and a tree to be desired to make one wise, she took up the fruit thereof and did eat, and all, and gave also to her husband with her, and he did eat. And, and the eyes of them both were open, and they knew that they were naked, and they sewed fig trees together and made themselves aprons. That basically means they try to hide this. I have a piece of Job. Job or Psalms? If I cover, if I cover my transgression like Job. Shit, mm -hmm. so, I say cover, I'm covering my mouth of my skirt. Mm -hmm. I need covering. Try to cover the self and blend in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And blend in with the nation. High in the trees, yeah. Yeah, high among the trees because they realize your shit with the transgress. And the Christian will read and think. <laughs> it's literal. Yeah, you take, take off the one that fig tree and get some chill and sort that fig tree, sort them leaves. They try to stitch it up, yeah. stitch up them leaves and put it on. Yeah. See, here, yeah, you Christians, dumb as hell. <laughs> but these, these women, they're not fast in this world here that we live in. It. These women are not fast. They're not fast. They're not for us. Alright? You might get a girl and she don't with you. You might get girls who don't with me. Don't want to rock with your hundred. Yeah. But somewhere down the line you go see a little fucking demon pop up in your head so and pull it. Yeah. What you said? Somewhere down the line you go see the little demon. They're moving good, 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 good all the time. And then the little demon that are hiding. They just show up in head. And then after, pull down so. Because the day, the problem will be come, you can But these women on them, they are. They are illegal.
secret is his world. They live with the world, but the source philosophy. Right? They live with it. Bishop just say when time she she scored, she lifted up her head, she scored, and you want something to write on. She just scored, yeah, when she went through the power. How do you feel? No, this is happy, sir. Right. Um, Proverbs 31 and verse 3 Give not thy strength unto woman, nor thy ways to that which destroyed kings. The evil woman to destroy kings. These kings. Yeah, they just call themselves kings. They just call themselves kings. I mean, Jacob is a king. Mm -hmm. Or king. Or we genuinely as kings. Don't let these women and them fucking destroy your king. Big man thing. Don't let them destroy you. Yesterday I told them to them about that. These women and them got tried to destroy them. One was fixing my car. Yeah, let them know that. They will try too. Don't give your strength to them because of... Ultimately, he wouldn't overcome. Who? Oh. Cousin? No, he wouldn't overcome. He wouldn't overcome. He's, um... Ecclesiastes 7 and 26. But they're the only man who will overcome is woman. <laughs> because as you bring out earlier, it's a rubber Shoot! Is it what prevail? Other sure, than sure. that, the woman was strong, right? Sure, sure. And it's not everybody who had the truth. Sure. Not everybody have the truth. It's only certain men. These men that have the truth. You know, the only the only most I will. You will get taken by her, but if it's not, it's um, Ecclesiastes 7 and 26, and I find more bitter than the, and I find more bitter than death the woman whose heart is snares and nets, and her hands as bands, whosoever pleases it, Yahweh Bashem Yahushai shall escape from her, but the sinner shall be taken by her. I'm going to be taken so once you know you know all this covering and the heavenly father you know in the street that woman will eat you up no she will eat you up but she's the second most powerful thing on the earth truth is the first number one truth after that is the woman yep so once you know all this truth you go and get take by you get take so stay in the truth is it because Again, we matter I say I want to call the name, but what go on with you is lose your wife, and then right after that, you can take it. Right after you lose your wife, you should start again less and less important too. See what's power they have? So remember when you when you were inside of it? Because I still stop with the Perspective always heaven. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Heaven on earth, man. I mean, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you are the wrong perspective always yeah, heaven. Yeah. So, the first player to play with your mind, yeah? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Fuck yeah. up your mind, man. I'm mad. Tell me, man. Anyway. Game show. Why are they here all to this? They're all to the Lord, yeah. You yeah, understand? Yeah. When, when that, 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 that kind of demon come on here, yeah? you overcome. Yeah. She just say, the elect, they overcome through the blood of the Lamb. Yeah. Nothing could hold them. Not this world, the cage of this world. Not that Eve, not the children, not the mother, not the father. Oh, yeah, what should I say? You gotta give up them things and yeah. follow me. Yeah. Bear a cross and follow me. Bear a cross and follow you. Because they all, you don't need the truth that can hold you. Mm -hmm. This world, this world is the only thing powerful enough to uphold you as a man in this world. Without this world, they will fall. Yeah. It's a hedge. Scripture said, the angels are the Lord. They camp around them that fear him and deliver it them. Because as we're going back to where we started, Satan desires to sift us as we. But the angels are around us. Right. But he's given us that hedge. So whenever Satan said, I want a minion, I angel block him off here. 
<laughs> and if you come there, you an exchange right there. And you come in the back and exchange your back and forth right there. And if you do fall, well then they, the Lord will send angels to help you to come out of that and repent. To, 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 to make your mind comfort you. Make your mind and um, at, get some comfort and repent out and come out of that. Not to come them yourself. Because the Lord can tell the angels on you to make you condemn yourself too. And say, boy, we ain't worthy enough. I know worthy enough. But I leave, yes. And make you condemn yourself because the angels have a part to play. Yep, yep. Them have a serious part to play. They, they make you. Them is the Holy Spirit, the angels. So when you have the Holy Spirit, where you feel, where you feel going on? It's angels coming to give you that understanding, give you that knowledge. If you have received spiritual power and all, is it is our angel, the Lord sent to give you that If you have the you speaking tongues, it's our angel. But then, all of that is part of the Holy Spirit, the Holy Spirit. If they are sitting there, are they not ministering spirit? Hebrews 1. Hebrews 1 chapter 8, the last verse. And then there are angels, the Lord will send them fucking, send you off course. Yep. Like King Saul. He tried, he tried all the time. He tried, he tried, he tried. And the Lord just wants to answer him. I don't see what he got to the country. See if you have a spirit from him. You went pray to the sleep for that because you saw what went on with Saul too. Right, right, right. <laughs> <laughs> you say, Lord, don't take not to your home. He's still from me. Because you see, you see what went on with Saul when Saul was here. He said, most, I, that, that was the most frightening thing to do. Because I, that, that, that Psalm 51 is, 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 is after um, Bathsheba. Mm -hmm. And then, and then Nathan the prophet came to him and explained to him about the man who had a, a, a lamb and got a man with plenty. And the man with plenty, come and take the man with one lamb, little lamb, taking the lamb to keep it. And they would say, we had to kill that man, like, who, who is that man, boy? Right? Nathan said, the lamb man is you, and they would say, me, I right? hmm. feel sorry. Most I tell them, hey, I'm far away, I sit, I ain't going back. That's how she had a lot of mercy on you, you got a mercy on you. You got a mercy. Exactly. The next man do that. And the Lord doesn't just sell him off. Yeah. But the Lord tell him, hey, what the hell do you say? He didn't show him mercy on David. Show him mercy on David. You got that. I want that too. Yeah. What? Definitely. Yeah, because that thing we do not knowing the Lord. You know? That things you do know in the Lord. Know in the Lord. Amen. This um second Samuel chapter twelve and verse is um eleven it says Thus saith Yahweh Bashami and Shai Behold I will raise up people against the out of thy own house. And I will take thy wives before thine eyes and give them unto thy neighbor, and he shall lie with thy wives in the sight of the sun. John Neva ended up being his own son, Absalom. For thou didst it secretly, but I will do this thing before all Israel and before the sun. And David said unto Nathan, I have sinned against Yahweh Bashami Awashai. And Nathan said unto David, Yahweh Bashami Awashai also had put away thy sin. Thou shalt not die. So the Lord had a power. But I will never be saved. I ain't going to kill you. You got to ask him unto death. Yes. So I ain't going to kill you for that. That is mercy. Right? That is the mercies of David. That is the mercies. The show mercies of David. And he said, Bless the man that the Lord did not impute iniquity. But, but, um, I was saying before that, is that uh, King David and the lambs, King David um, 
he, he took he took the, the, the man long. He took he took the man wife and he lied with the man wife. And on the other side, literally tell him, you see, mm -hmm. you see. Although he got some punishment, but at the, at the end of the day, the most I could show mercy, he feels the show mercy too. Yeah. If, he don't, if he don't want to show you mercy, he will show you mercy. He just say no mercy for you, none for you. So that is why David now, after uh, that I was talking about Psalm 51, David saw what happened to King Saul, that the Lord put an evil spirit on Saul. And he know he know transgress. So what are you things in the prayer? So I'm just one. What do you say? Say, cast me not away from thy presence. Save not thy holy spirit of me. Because he know the heavenly father had a power to freaking send your mind mad. Yeah, you know that. He know the Lord had the power to change his mind from serving him. Because he see what happened to King Saul. King Saul was going good. Can you show him when you're going to do the right things? And then bam, just so you want to kill David. Yeah. Yeah. That, that part of the, 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 the um, when you tell them to bring back, don't bring back no, no, um, no, none of them sheep, kill everything and you bring back the king and 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 the king Bring back all the fatted calf and say, the Lord, you want to sacrifice that for the Lord? You're lying. Why are you doing that? Why are you doing that? Instead of lying now, you bring back that for your own pleasure. Instead of taking it. Samuel Luzon, take the king and chop him up. Then before he even do that, he went and sacrifice, he went and, he went and make a sacrifice himself. Like a priest. Right. Samuel said, yo, what are you doing like this, sir? Mm -hmm. He went off there. Yeah, 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 yeah. And then he went off after when he went to Agar. Yeah. That was the day for, 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 for Saul. He had to go, you know? He had to go, no. go down the stream. King David knowing that, pray and say, Lord, don't okay, kill that. You got a scary thing. Yep. That more scary than anything else. You want to take it, you go and spur it away from it. Take my wife away from it. I don't want to see it. Like you see here. You know that? That's not in our, our lip. I'll get our next girl, but... You can't get back in all these girls. You can't get back in. That's gone and gone. That's how I was thinking. That's gone and gone and gone. You can get back that too. You see, but... First Samuel, first Samuel chapter, yeah, we go to 14. First Samuel chapter 13 verse. Right. First Samuel 13 and um, 7. It says that some of the Hebrews went over Jordan to the land of God and Gilead. As for Saul, he was yet in Gilgal, and all the people followed him trembling. And he tarried seven days according to the set time that Samuel had appointed. But Samuel came not to Gilgal, and the people were scattered from him. And Saul said, Bring hither, but bring hither a burnt offering to me, and peace offering. And he offered the burnt offering. They saw me not. He offered the burnt he knows what was going on, he knows that Levi. Right, right, right. right. You know mm -hmm. He went mad there. Eh? This is before he do the shit with Agar. Right, right. <clears throat> so that it came to pass that as soon as he had made an end of the offering, 
of offering the burnt offering, behold, Samuel came. And Saul went down to meet him, that he might salute him. And Samuel said, What hast thou done? And Saul said, Because I saw that the people were scattered from me, and that thou camest not within the, day, within the days appointed, and that the Philistines gathered themselves together at Michmash, therefore said I, The Philistines will come down now upon me to Gilgal, and I have not made supplication unto the Lord. I forced myself therefore and offered a burnt offering. And Samuel said to Saul, Thou hast done foolishly. Thou hast not kept the commandment of Yahweh by Hashem Yahushai thy power, which he commanded thee. For now would the Lord have established thy kingdom upon Israel forever, but now thy kingdom shall not continue. The Lord had sought him a man after his own heart. And the Lord had commanded him to be captain of his people, because thou hast not kept that which our Barashan Yahushai commanded thee. And this was even before Agar. Uh -huh. So Samuel did a piece of folly there. He, 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 I mean, Saul. He did folly there. Mm -hmm. Making sacrifice. We want to be to jump in the gun. To jump in because in order for. Well, to make a sacrifice, you have to be a Levite. But when you no know, sacrifice done, a man from the tribe of Judah made the ultimate sacrifice. That made us all priests. That made us all priests. All 12 tribes become priests. But you taking up the office of the priest before the man, the, the, the priest after the other Melchizedek made his sacrifice. You tried to take up the office of the priest. And it, it wasn't to be so, you I made mean, your jumping in God. So the Lord do so, Lord so, and right there he stripped, he stripped Saul of the kingdom. Then he went and did the folly with Agar. And well, that was, that was the final show right there. That was it. But he started to, he started to go mad. He had a wax worse and worse. He had a wax and worse. The Holy Spirit was being taken from him. And that is a scary thing. Yep, yep, yep. For the Holy Spirit to leave you. In um, Psalms 27 and verse 4, one thing have I desired of the Lord Yahweh by Hashem Yahushai, that, that will I seek after, that I may dwell in the house of the Lord Yahweh all the days of my life, to behold the beauty of the Lord Yahweh by Hashem Yahushai, and to inquire in his temple. So, I was gonna leave it next prayer. He 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 asked him, you know, to keep him all the days I like. Don't even take that Holy Spirit off a man. Keep me in this truth. Mm -hmm. <laughs> he would elect man as well. You know, he will fully elect man seeking for. They don't be seeking for. Mm -hmm. They stay in this. We don't wanna we don't want the Holy Spirit to come off of us. Right. We're gonna remain here yeah. until he yeah. until he grab the sky. Until he grab the sky. But why is it happening to work with man thing at Johnny Rohan? You know what I'm talking about, all these women and them done sex. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You know, keep on man and all that. You've done spoil already. The spoil. Rotten goods. Rotten goods. I mean, as I say, some of them, you know, it does, it does look good at it. It does catch up. The eye will catch up. Because, I mean, he's men at the end of the day and he's like, but they not to die for it because 500 one drop by drop one year 500 different men 40 men drop on next one no it's all girls next in 40 men 40 men no come on the yeah, next girl might drop, she body count is 120. And she go and come and tell you, oh, she put about 6 men in my life. Knowing that well, she still put about 120 men. 120 men that beat it up. And the next one might still put about 12. And she still put about 3 men in my life. And there's 12 men that be fast through them. No, it's 12, 12 men and all as a high now. Two, two, two men. Two high. 
Two of them. Two of them still alive. Two of them yeah. still alive. You understand? Because if a woman fucking her husband dead, she free the married in the Lord. Right? If she a part of this ministry, you know, I, well, I have a believing husband, you know, she can marry in the Lord. So, as Paul say, but other than that, two guys, plenty, boy. Plenty. You don't, that, you don't go on off there yeah. at different programming, and you don't know how it is even in, in the body. You pay, you, you put right. your, your DNA up in it, cannot go no way. That you mean in up in it. So a next man put any DNA up in it, like, Madness. Madness. I like. 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 He had it all how? All how. All how we put this one. And you had it. Because you get into do it now. Nah, but I'm a lie. The scripture says you have a share is our life. That is our life. You get up to say, hey, you get to use that Colossians 3 and 1. It says, if he then be risen with Amashia, seek those things which are above. Where a Mashiach sits on the right hand of the Most High. Set your affection on things above, not on things on the earth. For you are dead, and your life is hid with the most with a Mashiach in the Most High. When a Mashiach, who is our life, shall appear, then shall you also appear with them in glory. The hour shine is our life. When he appears, then he will shine. All of you will shine. Right? He will shine right now. The woman of this world, the scripture say, folly. Folly is in great dignity. Folly is in great dignity. And rich sit in a low place. Like this. You know, cars they play, we play in skeng, right? Skeng. Them girls and them like, men like skeng on them. Yeah. Some of the prettiest girls, like, men like skeng and skeng, bang on them. The fellas have a moral as well, you understand, you know. You wanna try and hold a, I sure, you try and hold a conversation with skeng, 